There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. to be a really quick video because I'm not really sure about how I feel about this wig but you know what either way here nor there we're gonna try to get through this and work this out so yes hunties yes this is by free trust equal and it's called the freedom part wig you can shift or rotate unit with freedom left center right part it is curling iron safe and it's supposed to be able to just shift it or whatever i do like the inside because it's very stretchy but the outside i'm not really fond of because there is was no way for me to tweeze this there was hardly any hair on this lace right here so i'm really not sure about this but you know what it's in a pretty color it is in the color purple i'm just going to call it purple because it has a whole bunch of other letters with it and yes yeah, so the style that i have is called freedom part 102 so it does have the combs, the standard combs like always, and the adjustable strap in the nape area. The color is really pretty. The hair texture is, of course, silky. And what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to take my brush and get in the crevices of this unit. This wig in general, you're not going to really be able to get a great part out of it. There's nothing like... Chilling with my girls, just me and my divas taking over the world. Divas, hey, divas. Let me tell you now, D. I Okay, I'm not going to continue on trying to style this because, first of all, there's no part. This looks horrible, like simply horrible. And on top of that, they're saying freedom part wig, shift or rotate unit with freedom. That's a lie. Um, that is totally a lie because if you shift this, as you guys seen, I did, it's uneven. And But the girl on the picture, hers looks so even but mine's is wrongly even like totally even i don't know where they want me to put the part at but it is on the left side of my head so with this wig you really cannot pull your hair out like that you you have to just like sit it on your head sit it on your head and go like this is not cool like this like it's very limp very limp at the top you know something this is like really horrible horribly made i'm not feeling this i don't like how thick it is right here i don't like there's no part um freedom part there's no part the, the freedom where's the freedom at on it look like it is being enslaved okay this part looked like it is being held against its own will for real like on some seriousness there is nothing freedom about or free about this, okay? Unless they're trying to give it away for free. Now, if it had a part, some lace, then it would be a totally difference, but... <sighs> this is for those who don't really care if people know that they have on a wig or not. This is exactly what this wig is for. Yes, yeah, so this wig right here, I'm... I'm going to say it's a, a no bueno in my book. I really don't like it at all. I don't really want everybody to know that I have on a wig. It's great, though, if you just throw on a baseball cap and wear it like that for the day. Then that would be cute, especially if you have a bad hair day. Bad hair day wig. Save it for a bad hair day if, if you decide to be bold and get it, even though I showed you what I didn't like about it, okay? So, yes. But anyway, other than that, you can check out Sister Wigs because they always have some bomb wigs. This just may not be one of them, but you know what? I came through and I let you guys know. So on that note, I will see you in an upcoming video. Stay diva and divalicious as always. Y'all don't have to tell me about the wig because I already know, okay? And don't thumbs the video down because you didn't like the wig. That's not what the thumbs down button is for. So on that note, I will see you guys really, really soon. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, and let me know what you 
don't let me know anything. <laughs> See you guys soon.